So last year a bunch of stuff happened as you can see. So today we're gonna be car shopping. And what better way to go car shopping by driving all of your dream cars here at Dream Racing. We've got Lamborghinis, we've got Ferraris, we've got the GTR, we've got Porsches, we've got everything you'd ever want to drive. And not just these cars are the cars we're going to be going over today. There's probably a bunch of other ones we might do because, you know, the sky is the limit. We could be driving RVs, we could fly helicopters, we could drive Jeeps, we could do all kinds of fun stuff. So, we're going to be doing a lot of shopping this year. Holy crap, this place is nice. Wow. I'm actually interested in shopping here. Dude, I'm actually interested in the, v in the RA. Okay, initials, and, and then we've got the three car drift. Oh, okay. Sorry, but so it looks like we're gonna do five laps in the C8, GTR, GT3 RS. Those are just like some of my favorite cars that are somewhat affordable, except the Porsche, obviously. They also might take us out drifting, which is gonna be different for me because I'm used to, usually I'm the one drifting. drift cars not just like a regular stock car going out being drifted so that was definitely a different experience than most it's like a street takeover <laughs> my son is never late for school <laughs> so they're gonna be taking us out on a car on the track without driving it gnarly just to show us how the track and like how to drive it properly you have to respect the power of these cars before just jumping in and going crazy so we're gonna kind of work our way up to you know the fastest cars I wish I could drive a car like this right now, but it's a little bit out of my price range, if you know what I mean. I'm sorry. I hate this so much. The car, for this reason, just makes me hate it. There's, there's, That's the only there's, reason? There's no reason for it. Look, there's no reason. It just, it's just Besides flipped. the fact that the car is a BMW, like, that's the only <laughs> <laughs> Such a troll. It's just super. I'm not even going to look at this. Look at, look at the cars that are around. You chose that one out of all the cars. There's, like, two Ferraris and a Lamborghini. Okay, okay. Here, yeah, see, thank you. You like this one because it doesn't have the thing. So. Yeah. Well, no, it has it here, and it actually works. <laughs> it actually works. Wow. Dude, That'd there's so fun. much room in here, bro. Look look at how much room there is. Like, I could be like, hey, let me just... Let me just sit over here and drive it. Oh, God. <laughs> Imagine be like, oh, it's drove a Ferrari. Dude, I like it. I don't know. I like the roominess of Ferrari. it. Ferrari. Ferrari. The forbidden honk. Oh, the horn is not there, I don't think. The airbag goes off. Honda Civic all over again. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> just trust me. It's pretty gnarly when a car's oil change is almost worth more than my car. <laughs> like, yeah, but I think the oil changes are less often than you think. A uh, Lamborghini oil change would probably be every 10,000 miles. Okay. Because there's so much more oil in it. I yeah. think. I don't know. Don't ask me. Why are you even listening to me? You don't drive a Lamborghini. Nah, I don't. I always drive a like, Every day I drive one. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I can't you. I can't even open it. It takes me two tries to open a Lamborghini door. Dude, this is so nice. Why the f would they let people drive this? I want to drive it. Do you want to drive this one? Dude, the fact that the guy said he doesn't care if you crash it as long as you sign the paperwork. Wait, really? Yes. Wait, who said that? <laughs> the, the whatever his name is. Like, the instructor. He's like, you can crash it. You sign paperwork, right? Then. <laughs> <laughs> A good accent. Yeah. Wow. That could work, actually. Like, imagine, like, I'm vlogging, like, what the, what the, what the, what? Like, can you move these seats at all? Or I'm they... surprised no one actually vlogs like that. The Corvette, the Corvette's pretty nice. I like this. Oh. Driver Jason, come on in. I'm only 15. I barely got my permit. Yeah, he Never has his permit with. now. I think I met Jason when he was 11. Now he has his permit. Yeah. So, you're driving. One thing I like about this, it seems fitted for you. It's kind of like a Supra. You know, everything's, like, in front of you. I don't know. Yeah, it's, like, driver-oriented. Yeah, exactly. Ooh. Ooh. And you even got couple. Damn! Okay. <laughs> it's an automatic car, so it's... Fun, you like it? Yeah, dude, this thing's sick. It's yours, I bought it for you. <laughs> Jason? <laughs> Such crap. Here you go, here's your key. I just gave you that supercar. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> that was so bad, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Get out, get, get out of the car. All right, so here's an RA. These are actually really nice because they're like a discounted version of a Lamborghini because you get the Lamborghini motor, but you get like a, it in an Audi, I guess. Oh, look, this one's manual. No, it's not. <laughs> it's a fake. It's a fake yule. This thing's pretty sick. Jesus, here you just do this and go. Dude, but look at the amount of space you don't have in this car. Corvette didn't have space. This Audi doesn't have any space. 
The Porsche doesn't have any space. The GTR has, you can fit in the back seat, which is pretty cool. You get and don't get certain things uh, for each thing, you know? So, like, if they're all super nice cars, and it's scary to drive a super nice car around. Trust me, I know what that's like. Speaking of a super nice car that wasn't nice before, I crashed my 240. I'm getting entirely rewrapped and redone. So, guys, look out for that video. I got brand new wheels for it, an entire new wrap. Alright, I don't like this car. You can tell this one's cheaper because it has door handles like this. Oh, it has door handles? <laughs> yeah. Piece of cheap crap. As the wheels straight up, we stop playing more and more speed. I am so excited after him driving the track and me getting an understanding of everything I'm so excited to feel the difference from each of these cars that I love so much and feel how each of them perform in their own ways It may seem simple to you guys that you just turn in gas break, but it's not it's totally different You have no idea if you think that's what you think that it's just it's totally different So I'm excited to actually feel these cars you ready? So what sit outside and no, you're not yeah, you're not driving. <laughs> you're yeah. gonna watch this thing is mint Yeah, man, right there I need to know everything. Who in the what and where I need everything. Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me. I'm curious, George. I hop in the Porsche, five on a horse. I'm ready for war. I'm coming for ghosts. I turn to a ghost. I need to know everything. But that was really just an understanding of the track right there. You were just telling me a second ago about the GTR? Some people crash because they don't understand how the turbos work. And this one has two. So this one should be fun. Alright, don't crash. Thanks, I needed that. They can never keep me down going. And if I ever fail the snow, I'll go again. I never quit because I know that every loss may lead to another win. I'm going now. That's fun. I bet when I land, they're going to tell me it's lucky. Can't see that I'm winning. It's harder to watch. I'm setting the stage. I'm setting the stage. He did better. Wow. He's, he's doing better, especially because he's with me. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Sorry, I drive real manuals, not fake manuals. So. experience was so awesome I can't wait to do some more shopping I got a couple things to do you know the drifting was awesome driving the C8 was awesome even the GTR I've never really been able to drive you know the cars like that you don't really often get to go out and drive a car and just take it around the corners like that like Lambo. something like this Lamborghini would be really really nice but the maintenance of it and like say something goes wrong it would just be so expensive to get it fixed I'd consider it I mean if it makes sense but like I want to be smart about the money that I have because it just doesn't just grow on trees your boy gotta work for it how often do you ever just get to take a Lambo out like that and just rip on it so that's what makes this so fun is that you're able just to just push the car to its limit. So I don't know if I said this, but I absolutely love the GTR. It was really fast down the straightaway. It wasn't so amazing around the corners, even though it's kind of heavy. I just enjoyed it a lot. I don't know why, but what it was, I just, I like the fact that there's four seats so I could just chuck two more people in the back and just say, screw it, we're all gonna go in and have fun. All right, so, go for it, pull the seat back. So like when I'm oh my God, that's... Stuff, like Hey, it looks like the uh, it looks like the Civic bit all over oh again. You're in the back. I'm in the front driving. Is this a bad idea? Uh, dude, imagine all four of us. What? What? <laughs> it won't stop beeping. All right, I'm done. See, this is why you shouldn't get the car. It keeps beeping. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> I think he's actually stuck back there.